guys, so today we are going to be doing our Cyber Monday Black Friday haul, um, or it was the other way around, Black Friday Cyber Monday haul. And um, I haven't received everything in the mail yet because some things are still coming and you know how that goes. But I kind of just wanted to show you the things that had arrived um, and just kind of get through them. It's not a lot of stuff. And also I kind of am in a new location today. This is my Christmas tree and it's black and I love it. All the ornaments on it are black. I just, I just love it. So um, I just wanted to get in the Christmas spirit here soon. So my tree has been up since before Thanksgiving because I just, I just, I just love Christmas. So, um, so yeah, so I have that, but let's not get distracted from the actual video, which is a haul. So Urban Decay was having a super amazing deal on their website. Um, I bought the Urban Decay electric palette and, um, they had an amazing deal on it. It was $29. They had it on sale for $29. This originally is, I think, um, $50, $49. So it was on sale for $29. And then on top of that, they had a 20% off coupon that you could use. And then um, they had free shipping. So I think I got it for $27, which is almost half of the savings plus no shipping. So I got a really awesome deal on it. So this is what the palette looks like. It looks just like the box. So this is what the palette looks like. It's super gorgeous. It has all these crazy electric colors and I just stabbed it like I usually do. And um, it comes with a dual sided brush, which I do like Urban Decay brushes. I think that they work really well. So it comes with like a flat shader side and then like a really small kind of detailer brush side so that's really great and I'm just so excited because recently I've been really getting into like doing colorful looks or more bold looks so um, I'm really excited about this palette like I really cannot wait to use this in a tutorial um, I'm gonna go ahead and swatch some of these for you guys so I swatched slow burn which is this shade here it looks like this this one right here is chaos and this one right here is trashed or trash trash thrash no it's thrash um, and oh they're so pretty aren't they gorgeous they're so pretty and I just honestly cannot wait to start playing with that it also came with an Urban Decay 24 7 velvet glide on pencil in black velvet which is just a black eyeliner and then it also came with this um, sample of the revolution lipsticks and i thought this was pretty cool because it has four of their most popular shades down here and it looks like you could get a couple uses out of each one and i've always wanted to try um, their lipsticks especially liar and 69 i think they're really pretty colors so there's that and then another really awesome awesome deal was from sephora i got the kat von d star studded palette because this was only $28. It was such an incredible deal. I could not pass it up. Like when I saw it in store, like I always pass up on her holiday palettes. Um, and most of the time I regret it because I think that she, I love her eyeshadows and I think um, they're quite beautiful, but I just don't feel like paying that much for them. And this one was $55 originally and it was for 20, I think they, they were selling it for 28, which was almost half off. So this is what the palette looks like. It's like a cardboard um, palette and it has the stars on it and it's quite pretty. It kind of reminds me of her um, her lipsticks that came out that are, you know, that have that same kind of texture. And so this is what the palette looks like. Again, I'm trying not to blind you guys, but um, so it comes with the sheet that has like all the names of the eyeshadows on it. And it's really cool because you can actually like tear it if you wanted to tear this piece off then you could totally do that but I don't really feel the need to and also because this is cardboard um, usually I don't really use the mirrors that come in palettes so this folds all the way back so then you can just see all the colors like that and this is what the palette looks like I mean it has really pretty like neutral shades and also um like colors like 
all these blues and greens and stuff. So it has like a really nice range of colors. And it also has a lot of different finishes. It has mattes, satins, her glittery shades, which are really pretty. Um, but they create a lot of fallout, but they're still gorgeous shades. So um, I just love them. I think they're so pretty. So I'm going to go ahead and swatch some of them. I swatched Mandela, Brass Knuckles, and Starflyer. Did I swatch it over the other one? Almost, but you guys can see, like, they're super bright and pigmented. I mean, look at this blue, though. And I, I pretty much picked the same color that I swatched in the Urban Decay palette. Sorry. I guess these colors are just calling to me, but um, I know my swatches suck. But they're so pretty. They're super pretty pigmented eyeshadows. All of Kat Von D's. I don't think I've ever had a palette that I thought that her eyeshadows were not pigmented. That's the only thing. It's like they're always really good quality shadows. Then I ordered some things from Target because um, I love Target, but sometimes their stuff is not available in stores. So I placed an order because they were having free shipping and then $3 off $15 worth of beauty products. And so it was, it was a pretty good deal. I bought the Sonia Kashuk um, Gilded Cage Brush Set. And it comes with, well, I'm sure this is blinding you guys. So it comes with an actual clutch. It comes with a clutch that you can literally, like, take it out, you know, go out somewhere with this. I thought this was really nice. It's not particularly my style, but I feel like if I was going somewhere, this would be so, like, super cute to take, um, and it's really sturdy and everything. And then it comes with these six brushes, which I love Sunny Akashic brushes. They're so soft and they are just really high quality. And this was originally, I think, $24 and I got them for $12, so half off. And um, this is what the brushes look like. They're just so gorgeous. I mean, I love her designs and I just... Love her brushes. They're super duper soft. If you guys haven't tried them, I definitely recommend going and purchasing these. These are $12.49, I think, on the website. And then if you order $25 or more, you get free shipping. And I'm not sure how long that promotion is running for. So the other thing that I bought to make up my $25 was this Pacifica Natural Skin Alight Multi Mineral BB Cream. And I love this stuff. I got a sample of it in my Ipsy Glam Bag. And when I first saw it, I was like, eh, whatever. It's nothing special. But this literally makes your skin look so amazing. This is an all-in-one bare skin tint. It's an illuminating primer, perfecting finish, age-defying skin care. I pretty much use this as a primer more than anything because um, it's such a light coverage, but if you are someone who doesn't really have any problem on their skin, you could literally just get away with putting this on your skin and then maybe like some sort of setting powder and you, would, you wouldn't need anything else. Um, it really is so, so gorgeous. It gives you like this really beautiful glow to your skin. So I really, really love it, but I can never find it in stores, so I just bought it online. And I think this was $15.99, if I'm not mistaken. And then the one deal that I can never pass up every year I purchase from this company is Sedona Lace. I love Sedona Lace brushes. I think they're my favorite brush brand because not only are they high quality brushes, they're so affordable. Like this regularly is... $79.95 or something like that. And on Black Friday, they have 50% off. And this year, they even did a Cyber Monday. And they their brushes were 50% off. So $40 for a professional brush set is quite incredible. I mean, these brushes are just so soft. They don't shed. They're just professional brushes. And that's actually what this is called. Is their 12-piece uh, professional makeup brush um, set in black. They have it in pink. And I think that's it. I think just have a black and pink. I think. I'm not exactly sure about that. But I just ordered the brushes and it came with like this brush belt, which I was like, what? Like, I was not expecting that, but still really awesome because if you um, travel or if you, um, you know, want to take these and, you know, actually do somebody's makeup, you can, you can just store it in here and take it with you and it's quite cool. So it comes with like a blush brush, um, 
stipple brush, a contour, angled contour brush, a foundation, uh, eyeshadow brush, another eyeshadow brush, a blender, a pencil blender, um, like a flat, like maybe concealer brush. I think this is meant to be concealer as well. And an eyeliner and another angled brush. So, I mean, the quality in these is amazing. I think out of all the brush brands out there, these are my favorite. So, um, love them. And then I ordered two separate brushes that were not in any kind of um, set. I just wanted some extra brushes. And I got two blending brushes. This one here is a super tiny little blending brush. And this one is 311, and it's just like more of a detailed kind of blending brush, which I really wanted to try. And then I just got one of their regular kind of blending brushes. It just looks like this. It's just a regular, you know, kind of blending brush. I love blending brushes. I think they're my favorite thing out of all brushes. Blending brushes are the thing. And then just some things that I just picked up recently. They're not from the Black Friday, but I found them for a really good deal. Um, so the first thing is this Fit Me Maybelline blush, and this is called Deep Moth. And it's just a super light blush, which I really wanted to try this. I thought maybe it would kick up a little bit more um, color to it, but I don't think that you'll be able to see this maybe on my face, but not on my skin because it kind of just blends into my skin but I thought it was an interesting color and I got it for like three dollars so I was like oh I'll try it I'll try it and then the other thing are these nails these are the impress press on manicure nails and that's what they look like they're just like a red color got these because I didn't want to get my nails done anymore and I was letting my nails grow out and they were long but then one of them broke so I just went ahead and cut all of them off because I hate when they're uneven. So I bought this to kind of help protect my nails while they grow out and I definitely recommend those. And then I got this Fuse Gel Enamel um, or Gel Enamel machine to do gel nails because I tried uh, shellac nails for the first time. I think the week before Thanksgiving and I loved it the only problem is that it's $28 like for nail polish really like I don't know if it was just the salon that I went to I don't know how much do you guys usually pay for it because I paid $28 which I thought was a bit much because you can get a set of nails like acrylic nails for like $30 so I was just like really though really it comes with a little lamp that you use to set the gel nails and then it comes with an actual nail polish and then it comes with um, the cleanser, a double-sided nail buffer, a manicure stick, one pack of lint-free wipes, and then the actual gel color. And I got it for $7.99. These usually are $15.99. And Walgreens was having a sale on this, so I thought it was a pretty awesome deal. And then their actual gel nail polishes right now are on sale for like $3.99. So um, it's just a little machine that you can um, connect to. The wall to kind of um, charge and then you can just use it one finger at a time which is fine with me I mean I don't care I just don't want to pay $28 every time I want to get my nails done so um, and then it just comes with this really pretty like glitter um, gel polish so I hope you guys enjoyed this haul video and there will be a second part of it because not everything arrived and I wasn't able to haul it so um, when that when everything comes in, then I'll do a separate video on those. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And until next time, I'll talk to you guys very soon. Bye!